Hey, you're finally awake. We just crossed the border. I've heard strange things have been happening since I was away. Even so, it's good to be back home. Back in Skyrim. Jar of the refined brew? Let's talk over here. Luck was with us. If we had reached this camp even a few moments later, Sable I would have gotten away with the Netherroot brew. This looks like the jar of refined brew we found in Singalis's laboratory. After all this trouble, Fen better be able to use it to make his elixir. I'll take the jar of refined netherroot brew to Solitude. We'll meet up in Svana's chambers when everyone gets back from their missions. I hope they're alright. You seem to have grown fond of Fen and Savanna. Fen has proven himself, especially after what happened in Blackreach. House Ravenwatch, they're unusual as far as bloodsuckers go. As for Svana, she's braver than I originally thought. Anyway, meet me in solitude after you finish up. What else do I need to do? In addition to the refined netherroot brew, Fen needs information on the Ice Reach Coven medallions. Plus, we're hoping to learn more about the big storm the Grey Host has planned. Help Fen and Svana at the other camps, then meet me in solitude. We learn more about the medallions at the coastal camp. Fen is on his way back to the Blue Palace. Glad to hear that worked out. With any luck, Fen will produce a working elixir in short order. Then we can stop worrying about the Harrow Storms and concentrate on defeating the Grey Host. Which reminds me, go to the Blackreach camp and aid Svana. Okie dokie, I'll see you back at the Blue Palace. Um, yeah, I want to go to that lift there, I believe. At least I hope. Um, nope, I don't want to go that way. <gasps> A harrow storm! It's close by, I think. Yeah! First we go to the harrow storm. Alright, we're gonna do it with just the four of us, really?
Ah, fuck. Didn't want to do that. Trying to get out of the way. I was trying to get out of the way. What's going on here? Enjoy your freedom from oblivion. Ouch. Dude, that was painful. The offerings. Ouch. God damn. Come on. Oh shit. <laughs> I didn't realize my matriarch died. All right, we're gonna go over a year. Oh, we recover. There's no healers around. So good. So far, so good. To help the dude, but so far, so good. Almost got him. Where is he? Did we get him? Oh, we got him! Yay! <sighs> awesome sauce. Awesome sauce. Good job, guys. We did it. We did it. GG. Okay. <laughs>
Now that I, uh... Okay, where do I need to go? I got way off track here. Um... There was a... Okay, we're getting closer. After all that traveling and getting lost. One thing about Black Reach, I always get lost in Black Reach. It never fails. I always have a hard time getting around here. And I don't know why. Is it right down there? Oh, there's Fauna. God damn it, run! Damn these hero storms and what they do to my people! I came here to learn what the Grey Host has planned and what did I find? Good citizens of the Holds, afflicted by the Harrow Storms and kept prisoner for some ungodly purpose! No matter how many I set free, the Herald will not leave this place. Have you had an opportunity to scout out the Grey Host camp? That's all I've been doing, and trying to get these afflicted people to leave this place. The Herald, the storm robs them of their will, their minds. I wasn't able to slip deeper into the camp, though. We need to try to find out about the big storm the Grey Host is planning. Agreed. There appear to be a number of Grey Host warlords in the camp, so discovering their plans should be possible. We need to be careful, though. I don't want us to wind up like the Herald, serving as food for these bastards. Tell me what you noticed while scouting around the camp. Messages have been coming and going since I arrived. I've heard the name Radha Al-Saran, the Ashen Lord spoken in hushed and revered tones. His name was on the communique you found, remember? We need to get down there and see what else we can learn. I wonder what the Grey Host is doing down here. Hiding, building their forces, digging, undermining. That's the correct term, I think. Plus, they're collecting the Herald, herding them like cattle. It's monstrous what they're doing to these poor people. Are you sure you should be down here, Princess? The only thing I'm sure of is I have to try. If my father won't act, then it falls on me to get things done. It's... it's what my mother would want me to do. Maybe. Maybe not. Okay, so... We gotta go this away, and there's... Looks like a death hound, yeah. But they ain't bad. Another death hound. Look, and then scout. there's one of those uh, stormtroopers. I left the orders in my tent, but the Ashen Lord was clear. We need more Netherroot. See to the Undergrove immediately. As you command, Pintok. The Undergrove? That sounds important. Oh, did he see us? Okay. Got him. There's another vantage point over here. Oh, we could ignore that death hound. There, on the left. Let's listen in. Um, on the left? Okay, let's get these guys first. On the left. Let's go up here. Maybe up here? 
Ah, over here. Exarch Zingalis has fallen. I have never seen Rada El Saran, our Ashen Lord, so feel the sorrow or such rage. Does the loss of the Exarch alter our plans? Not in the least. The strike on Solitude will occur as planned after Exarch Ulfra tests the improved ritual in the Undergrowth. An attack on Solitude? We need to move quickly. The Grey Host definitely has something big planned. Let's search the tents for a copy of those orders. Okay, let's do that. I think it's... Okay, he got him. All right. Grey host orders. My beloved kin, I have no words. Zingalis is dead. His killers have retreated to the shadows. Doubtless they mean to harry us in our righteous labor. Already there are whispers of them seeking to stop the spread of the Harrowed. I will not abide any further threats to our goal. My family will be delivered from their torment, and not even Molag Bal himself can stop me. To that end, we must accelerate our efforts. All preparations regarding the attack on Solitude must be completed post-haste. To that end, make sure everything required for the work in the Undergrove is ready. The location is hidden and secure inside the ancient barrow, which fell into the earth for just this purpose. It will make a perfect testing ground for the next stage of the Harrow Storms. Exarch Ulfra shall lead those efforts and prepare the way for the final Harrow Storm. Grey Host Victorious. Rada al Saran, the Ashen Lord. That's what we were looking for. Let's talk over there. <laughs> Three steps away, okay. Orders <laughs> from Rada al Saran. His words and the chill down my spine. Their plan for solitude? It might even be more dreadful than an all-out attack. We need to get back and determine the exact location of this undergrowth place. You really think Solitude is in danger? You saw what happened at Kilkreath and Karthwatch? Whatever they have planned for Solitude, it sounds a whole lot worse. I wish we knew more about this Rada al Saran and what drives him. He makes it sound like he considers his army to be his family. A family of monsters? Who could imagine vampires and werewolves working together? Let alone talking about one another like brothers and sisters. It's not natural. Let's hope the orders we found will give us an advantage. I'm glad I got to look around Blackreach, but... I can't wait to see the sun and sky again. No matter how big these caverns are, it still feels like we're buried alive down here. What else do I need to do? We came down here to find out what the Grey Host has planned. But Fen still needs information about how the medallions are created, and a sample of the refined netherroot brew. Help Fen and Lyris at the other camps. Then meet me in Solitude. We got the medallion information and the netherroot brew. Fen and Lyris will meet us in Solitude. Then we're done here. I hope we found enough to end the threat of the Grey Host. I'll meet you back at the Blue Palace. Good luck, my friend. Good luck to you too. This guy's gonna be rude again. What is it? Well, not so bad. Nothing, I'm just here to see the princess. is still in mourning. So, do we have a way to defend against the Harrow Storms, or what? The Elixir should do what we need, provided neither Fen nor I made any miscalculations. 
Yolin, don't be so negative. The elixir will work. You'll see. Oh, good. You're back. Mjolin and I have been discussing the various ways to turn what we've got into a protective elixir. I'm hesitant to get too excited, but I think we've figured out how to defend against the Harrowstorms. Oh? Tell me what you're thinking. The Grey Host uses an unstable mix of alchemy and sorcery to create the Harrowstorms. An arcane ritual and the Netherroot Brew focus the power of each Harrowstorm through the prepared Witch Pikes. Ingenious, but fully exploitable. Exploitable? How so? We can use the refined brew as the basis of our elixir. Now that we understand how the Harrowstorms are created, we can use those same components to replicate the medallion's protective properties. We just need to gather the necessary components. I thought we gathered the necessary components. What else do we need? How can I help? Svana's associate, Mog, will procure most of the supplies I need. But there's one final ingredient required. For various reasons, I can't simply walk into the Hall of the Dead and claim it myself. I need you to acquire R.K.'s Sacred Oil. R.K.'s Sacred Oil? A holy ointment associated with a god that became popular due to Imperial influence. It's used by the priests in the Hall of the Dead to provide protection against necromancy and the undead. We need that oil to create our elixir. Okay. I will procure it for you. You'll need my help. I'll meet you at the Hall of the Dead. Mog, put away the tankard and get the supplies Fen requires. Yes, your royal ladiness. <laughs> Your royal ladiness. <laughs> I like Mog. Okay, so we gotta go to the Hall of the Dead, which is right by the Way Shrine. Look at that bear's head sticking in the door. <laughs> And the Hall of the Dead is right here. Cards or refugees arrive by the hour. Why does Fargrim hesitate? Plain old the High King oh, issues no. orders, but all they do is lock away the afflicted. Princess Vana. When will we strike back? What can I do for you, Your Highness? Listen to my friend, High Priest. We need your help. I'm surprised to see the princess here. As you can see, the influx of refugees has made this place much more hectic than usual. Is there something I can do for Princess Svana? Yes, actually. We need some RK sacred oil. Sacred oil? Strange. That's the second time today someone has come seeking RK's anointing balm. Sword Thane Arthlet arrived with an edict from the king. Demanded our entire supply. How we're to consecrate the dead without it, I have no idea. Why did the High King want all the sacred oil? The Sword Thane wouldn't say. He just mentioned that the High King needed it to defend solitude. I'm sorry I can't comply with the Princess's request. Things are hard enough that these refugees must take shelter here among the dead. Do you know where the Sword Thane took RK's sacred oil? The sword thing took the oil to Castle Dower. That's where all the supplies for a siege are gathered during periods of strife. I pray that High King Svargrim receives the patience and wisdom required to see us through this crisis. Tell me more about Castle Dower. Solitude's foundation began with the construction of Castle Dower. It's the oldest structure in the city, and the most defensible. I tried to move the refugees there for safekeeping, but my request was denied. The High King has other plans, I suppose. Other plans, eh? Thank you, High Priest Ingert. 
Guess we will talk to Uthlet. Our business is urgent. My friend will explain. I don't have time for the princess's proclivities right now. The High King... We barely keep up with the multitude of tasks. So speak quickly, and let me get back to it. The High Priest said you took all of the sacred oil. The princess needs some of it. My orders from the High King were clear. Stockpile the entire supply of sacred oil in the Temple of the Divines here within the confines of Castle Dower. What in Shore's name does the princess need with holy oil anyway? There's an elixir that protects against hair storms, but it requires the sacred oil. Protection? Truly? The Harrowed already outnumber my soldiers and more arrive every day. Still, giving you the oil would violate the High King's edict. I suppose if I happened to look the other way for a moment, I wouldn't notice if a flask disappears. I understand. single flask? Then we'll have to make do. Let's get it back to... Fortain! By his work! Oh I boy. gave strict orders, yet my daughter freely enters the castle grounds. What do they want, sir? They, um... We came to offer our assistance, Father. Sort thing. How can we help? Athlet has everything well in hand, child. Despite your intentions, you would only hinder our efforts. Go! The sword thing doesn't need my daughter or her wastrel underfoot. Okay, so somewhere along here we gotta stop and talk to Svana. Look, Svana, your dad's a jerk. My father's never been what I'd call a warm and caring parent. But this crisis has made him even more distant. Let's get this sacred oil to Fen. My father will certainly change his attitude once we present the protective elixir to him. I wonder why your father doesn't want us in Castle Dower. He's trying to protect me. It's what he does. And leave me out. Though I suppose that's mostly my own fault. I know Mother's death weighs on him, as does this entire crisis. That's why we have to help. This elixir is going to work. It has to. But why seal off this old fortress? It's not that unusual. Castle Dower is the most defensible part of the city. In the past, we'd gather the people inside the walls. Now my father is using the fortress to house the Herald. They need to go somewhere, right? Come on, let's go. I don't know. Something sounds very fishy to me. I think this is going to be a good place to end this episode. We will continue our adventure in Western Skyrim tomorrow. Thank you so, so, so much for taking the time to check out my video. And of course, if you enjoyed it, smash that thumbs up for me and feel free to leave a comment. Be safe, be well, and I will catch you in my next video. Bye!